hello everyone welcome back to our channel i hope you are doing great wherever you are in today's video we are going to talk about mixtures and the question we have here is about mixtures it reads a miller was contracted to make porridge flour to support a feeding program he mixed millet sorghum maize and omena in the ratio one to two to five to one the cost per kilogram of millet was 90 shillings, sorghum 120 shillings, maize 30 shillings, and omena 150 shillings. Then calculate A, the cost of 1 kilogram of the mixture, and then B, the selling price of 1 kilogram of the mixture if the millet, or rather if the miller made a 30% profit. Right to part A, we are required to get the cost of 1 kilogram of the mixture. What we'll do here is you say cost of mixture per kilogram will be obtained by having cost of sorghum, cost of maize, omena and that of millet summed up. And just to note, the ratios here should represent the masses remember we have millet to sorghum to maize to omena so one here represents the mass of millet two represents the mass of sorghum five maize and one omena we will have the cost of millet per kilogram as 90 shillings and the how many kilograms one kilogram so we have for millet one kilogram times 90 shillings for every kilogram and then we'll have to add that to sorghum so we have for sorghum the cost is 120 shillings per kilogram and there are how many kilograms we have two kilograms then we have five kilograms for maize and then each kilogram is 30 shillings and finally for omena we have one kilogram is 150 and there there is only one kilogram so one times 150 then this is the cost of all the masses and if we are to get the cost of the mixture for just one kilogram we'll have to divide the whole of this by the total mass and that is 1 plus 2 plus 5 plus 1 so on the numerator we have 90 plus 240 plus 150 plus 150 so that is 90 plus 240 plus 150 plus 150 that is 300 all over 3 plus 5 plus 1 that is 9 here we are going to get 630 over 9 and that is 70 shillings per kilogram well that is for part a for part b we are told calculate the selling price of one kilogram of the mixture if the miller made 30 percent profit we need to understand that cost of the mixture per kilogram is equivalent to buying price and we know that buying price is usually set at 100 percent therefore if the miller sold and made a profit of 30 percent then what is the selling price we'll therefore say so this implies that if 100 percent for the buying price is cost of the mixture which is 70 shillings how about 130 percent remember when sold a profit of 30 percent was made that is on top of the 100 percent we have 30 percent so that is how we get 130 so this will be what this is for selling price cross multiplying will get 130 over 100 times 70 and that should give us 91 shillings 
and that is it for this question thank you for watching see you next time